can't go out of here. There's a window on top of the door? Alright, thanks, because I was stuck. I was definitely stuck there. Uh, that's dumb that I can't go under that way, that I have to go this way. A window on top of the door that you missed. Let's see. It's open. So can I boost her in? The window's open up there. Is that a good idea? Maybe I could look in. We don't even know if there's dead people in there. Why don't I put you on my shoulders and you can peek into that window up All there? Alright, we're just gonna Sounds have a look. Good. A look is good. <sighs> okay, I can see in. What do I do now? Look for the dead ones. What do you see? Lots of crates and stuff. Maybe we can find the key or figure out a way to knock this door down. Kenny'd probably have me pick the lock, which actually might work now that we have the time. I think I opened it. Oh, for real? Okay. I think so. Well, that was easy. Well, I'll be damned. Clementine has superpowers now. All these things I taught her. Let's go. Be careful. I'm supposed to tell you that. Somebody typing? God damn, it's dark in here. Jail? Maybe I can hold the door open? I don't like that. I'll prop it open with something. Uh, box? What's this? Banner. Wish that thing was in my hands instead of over there. It's too dark otherwise. The time is running out. What the hell? Here we go. How we doing? Good. What do we need? Something to help us deal with the tanker out there. It's locked up good, but there's some space at the top. We're lucky I'm so little. Yeah, we are. Man, I'm going to be so pissed off if I throw Clementine over this thing and she gets killed. What all's in here? They didn't have much business back then. That's exactly what we need. What is that? Over there? Yeah, we need to get in there and get that blowtorch. Torch? Tor yeah, blowtorch. All right. Uh, come on, Clementine. You okay going over the top of this fence? Yeah, definitely. How's she gonna get me the blowtorch, though? Go on and grab the keys, Clem. The keys are in here? Come on, scoot. Shit, what? No, no, Behind no. Thank you! Fuck! <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, it's gonna be on her. <laughs> Buffet time. Well then. Alrighty then. Go on and grab the keys, Clem. Come on. Scoot. Behind you. Fuck. <laughs> Give me my damn tool! Uh. Hasn't Clementine seen enough? Go on and grab the keys, Clem. Come on, scoot. What 
did I teach you to shoot for, girl, if you're not going to help me out? Come on, Clementine. Everything's fine. Oh shit! 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 Clementine, you gotta do this. Keys now. Give me the key. Give me the key. Give me the key. Give me the key. Fuck! It's still locked. Give me the key. Put the key in this fucking thing. Pull this bitch open. So good. No, it didn't. I died a couple of times. But we're okay. Everything's okay. What's going on? I thought I heard a gunshot. We're fine. We found some walkers. You and an eight year old versus three of them, huh? Yeah, so? that supposed to mean we handled it yeah it looks like what if you hadn't I'm gonna go make sure the noise didn't cause us any problems that's a good idea I got enough bitches in this game just so you know I hope you know what you're doing with her me too for her sake All right, let's get our gear. Just like in real life, we're all just doing the best we can with what we got. What did we learn? I'm not ready for a gun. We learned not to be afraid. They should have got us, but we got them. Yeah, you're right. Fear is the thing that will kill us. You understand? The only thing we have to fear is fear itself. Is there anything else worth grabbing in here? I just need that, right? Come on, Clem. Let's go. I think Clementine could have shot the walker herself. You just chose to save her. But I didn't want to leave it up to chance, I guess. She might have done it, huh? I found a blowtorch in the station. Should make quick work of the coupling up there. Excellent. I'll come up there with you to have a look. Oh, meat is just like a ray of sunshine compared to Krista. It's nice to have a positive person, but I'm just so jaded now that I'm I'm a, a paranoid of people who are too positive. All right. Yeah, just like in real life, everybody's just doing the best they can, Ninja. Nobody's perfect. Everybody makes mistakes. Everybody makes poor decisions. What's that? We need a match. Oh, so a leak in it. Oh. Turn it off, dude. I, I don't want my Wait, I got my off. tape. Tape. I got my tape. Better plug that leak with something. I got my tape. Hope there's holes. It'll do fine, Lee. Spark it up. That's crazy. Look at it go. Just about got. He loves everything. Oh shit, he saved me. Whoa, thanks. No sweat, man. This thing is hanging by a thread. The smallest cut and it'll go. Damn it, it was just about done, too. Crap. Do it anyway? Can't reach it now. 
Ah, I can't reach it now. How about if I hold your legs, Omid? Yeah, you can do it. Portion of the couplings out of my reach. You think it'll be within mine? <laughs> no, but I'm gonna dangle you over that ledge. What the hell you are? <laughs> God, you're a real son of a bitch, aren't you? Shut up and start cutting. Oh shit! Oh, there's a fucking horde coming! Get the train going! Oh! Guys, there's something coming! What the what? There must be thousands. We gotta go! Fuck! Oh me! Cut! Cut! I am! It's going! Pull me up! Go! We're gonna jump on the train from the other side of the bridge. Oh shit, the gas is pouring out. What the hell do we do now? We're gonna torch this is fuel. Nice. Holy crap! We're torching this fuel. And we're jumping on the other side. Let's go, man. We gotta jump! What? No way! Come on, Omid, I got you. I got you. I held you one time. Guys! Come on! Have it your way. I will! You son of a- ah! No! Shit! Oh! Run! No, can I rewind that? Grab the people! Grab the people! Grab the people! No! Her! Not me! Brista, no! No! Fuck. No! Oh my god! She's a woman! Don't you know? Oh! It's okay, honey. I'm okay. I thought he was pussying out and he wasn't gonna jump so I just skipped that sip and dialogue I thought that I was gonna say jump and he wasn't gonna go so I just said I'll just push him now uh... sorry oh me <laughs> oh man I thought he was gonna puss out if I said jump he was gonna be too afraid and it, it led me to believe of the other options that I was going to have to push him. So I said, I'll just skip the step and push him now. I didn't realize he was going to bounce off. Ah. Next stop, the Atlantic. Kenny, this is for you. We're finding Clementine's parents when we get there. I thought they were dead. Looking for them then. That's not the plan. Well, it's ours. She and I talked it through. It's gotten too bad, you know. You, me, nobody can take all this. But we have. What we're supposed to do isn't clear anymore give anything to go back to fighting over the motel. <sighs> the good old days. Too. I'll leave you to your thoughts. She's out cold like I've never seen. <laughs> I've wondered if somebody was going to start talking on this walkie. Once, once, we, once we got batteries for it. wait for you to get this right here and you be sure to find me whether Lee wants you to or not now what I need holy shit I thought that fucking thing was broken 
So did I. See, when I saw her talking on it. If he's convinced Clementine that he has her parents, y'all might want to rethink your plan. When I saw her talking on it, I said, what if somebody's actually talking to her on the other end of this thing? We're almost at the river. Hey, we'll Omid. Boat, sorry about your leg. The walkers figure out we're here. I know I promised that we'd find your parents. But Savannah's more dangerous than I thought it would be. I don't know how much longer he can keep on like this. Oh, man. If his leg gets any worse, we're going to have to carry him. Or leave him. If I were you, I'd get out of the street. Now. Who the hell is this? Answer me, damn it. So when were you going to tell us about the radio? Uh, who are you talking to? You come back here, I'll kill you. You understand? I will kill you. Yeah, I don't like how it shows a snip of what will happen next either. I don't need to see the coming attractions. Did you shoot the girl in the street? You and 40% of players shot her. Did you abandon Lily? You and 57% of the players did not leave her. Did you fight Kenny? You and 44% of the players talked him down. Did you shoot Duck? You and 79% of the players shot him. Did you help Omid? You and 55% of the players helped Omid. Does that mean help them, like, pushed him? I don't know. I guess I should have let that play out more. But I kind of got the feeling that the way it was written was that if I said jump, he was going to be like, I'm too scared. To be honest, Duck was really effing annoying. Duck was just kind of a goober. Duck! Yeah, I agree, Ninja. I kind of like it all to be a surprise. I don't need to see the coming, you know, next time on. I just want to play it fresh and not have any idea. But I kind of find that I'm forgetting when I, once I get into it, I forget about that stuff. But, all right. The Long Road Ahead. So that's episode three in the books. Thanks for watching, everybody. We'll start episode four next time. That wasn't too much longer. Nice. Yeah, I really dig this series, though. It's, it's well done. I like it. I like it that even if you screw up, we just move on, you know? Yeah, see, it's Night Ninja. It's not like uh, some of the other games I've been trying to play where I get stuck in a spot and going over it again and again and I feel like I'm not making any progress. At least I know we're pushing forward here. See you later, man, but nothing can beat Life is Strange. Yeah, Life is Strange is pretty good, too. You can watch it back, Josh. You can watch it back. Life is Strange is pretty good, too. I heard they're going to make a, a movie out of Life is Strange, which I think that would actually be a really good feature film. So, all right. That's it for me, guys. We'll see you later. Thanks for hanging out. Have a good one. Bye-bye. I know, it's not real time, but you could pretend. You could pretend, Josh. Okay, bye-bye.